Hey you guys, it's Tati or Tatiana, whatever you want to call us. So listen, um first and foremost what we want to say to our black people is that y'all must stop attacking other black people who have different perspectives. Y'all must stop attacking black people who just don't go along with everything that the black community do. Y'all must stop attacking black people who choose to see things in a more positive way and choose not to interact with white people who is coming at us in a negative way with more negativity. Y'all just need to stop that. Just for clarification. Now, Chadwick Boseman, we believe that's how you say his name. Now, recently there have been pictures placed up of him looking very skinny and sickly. He looks like he's sick as fuck. Now, what we want to tell y'all from the human per I mean from the spiritual perspective is your your brain's first reaction when you see him in that way is oh my gosh, I wonder why. Or well, why is he not telling us why he's sick? Or or something in a panic way because the way that he visually looks, it it makes your brain get in super concern. Then y'all start being super nosy, invading in people's personal space and not respecting their boundaries, wanting to call their publicists, wondering why they're sick. This is not none of y'all business. Yes, he is a public actor, but that is his choice to be in the public. Who are y'all to invade in these people's privacy? Okay, now we want to give y'all some advice from the spiritual perspective. Your human brain will always react to what it sees in reality. No matter what, if you get some bad news, your brain's going to respond and react in 2.4 seconds, which is only natural for the brain. But you, being a spiritual being, must be conscious and be aware. Once your brain begins to do that, you need to tell your brain, all right? Instead of us focused on his sickness, let's begin to focus on a picture of him being healthy and positive. Meaning, your brain's going to continue to focus on how he looks, but you have to jump over that and make your eyes view something totally different. Okay? So instead of you viewing him as sickly and unhealthy in this moment, what you should do is begin to look in the future as him being healthy and full of vibrance in life. Don't allow your brain to focus on what is happening negative. Create the future. Create him being happy. Create him being healthy. Focus on that. And you putting out that energy will help him get healthy. You don't even have to be in the same vicinity. Energy will meet him exactly where he is at. And that's how we can help him get better. Because sickness starts in the brain. So his brain is sick right now. And something is making his brain feel that way. And because we are unaware of that, what should what what we should be doing is putting out of energy of healthy, loving, and healing. Not focus on his actual sickness because that's making his energy even worse. Because his energy is already sick. See what I'm saying? So we should be putting energy of healthiness into him, not healthy, I mean not sickness. But that's all we wanted to say to y'all today. Um yeah, like, we send him good energy, loving, healing energy for whatever him and his brain is going through in this moment. It's not a place that we should be worried why. That's that's none of your business. That's your brain being nosy. We get that to you. It's, it's, it seems like concern, but that's something that your brain shouldn't be concerned with because it's none of your business. See what I'm saying? Just focus on sending him good energy, good healing energy. And we guarantee you, over time, you will begin to see him looking healthier. We love y'all. Like, comment, and subscribe. Um, follow our Instagram, please. Um, it is She Speaks Brains. Also, everything is the same on all social medias. Thank you, guys. Bye.